Hello everyone, welcome to My Chem Corner. Today we are going to find solution to exercises in NCRT grade 11 chemistry book from chapter 1, some basic concepts in chemistry. Before we move into the video, if you have any requirement for online chemistry tuition, please don't hesitate to drop a mail to the email ID displayed on the screen. Question 1.6. Calculate the concentration of nitric acid in moles per liter so this is the first clue that gives us an idea that we need to check for molarity because the SI unit for molarity is moles per liter in a sample which has density 1.41 gram per ml and mass percent of nitric acid in it being 69 percent so in our question there are a few details given to us first one is let's find out what the 69 percent of nitric acid means so here 69% of nitric acid means 69 grams of nitric acid in 100 grams of solution. So that is the data you get from uh, 69%. Next one is another question, the value that's given to us in the question is density of nitric acid being 1.41 gram per ml. So these are certain readings given to us and the question asked is calculate the concentration in moles per liter. So let's check what the formula for molarity is. So molarity is nothing but number of moles of solute by volume of solution in liter. That is the formula but here we'll just take it in ml which means in the numerator liter will be applied. So here for all this to, to know what the molarity is we need to find out what is the number of moles because that is not given to us in the question. Along with that, we have to also find out volume, but volume will become easier to find because density is given to us. So first, let's use the number of moles formula. So number of moles is nothing but given mass by molecular mass. So before we find out what is the number of moles, we need to find out what is the molecular mass of nitric acid. And when we calculate, you get the molecular mass of nitric acid as 63. And given mass is given to us in the question which is 69%, we just found out what is the given mass. So it is 69 divided by 63 which will be 1.09 moles. So now we got what is required in the numerator. Number of moles is already there. But we don't have what is the volume. But we can find out volume from density and the mass given to us. So now what we will do is find out what is the volume. So density formula is mass by volume and if we need to find out what is the volume you put mass here of nitric acid solution not just nitric acid but nitric acid solution. So the mass of the solution here is 100 grams. So we put 100 divided by density. Both are in grams so it will get cancelled and the resultant uh, value that you get will be in ml which is 70.92 ml. Now we know what is the value for volume, we know what is the value for number of moles. We just have to substitute both these values in the formula given here. So when we substitute it, 1.09 is number of moles into 1000 as per the formula divided by molarity which is 70.92. Or we can also convert this to liter and you don't have to use the 1000 on the numerator here in that case. So you can just convert this volume directly to liters and still substitute. Anyway, you will get the answer right. So when you calculate molarity, you will get 15.36 mole per liter. Question 2.7. 